Okay, back doing another Fat Finger demo, and this video is actually intended for people that don't have so much Emacs experience. So, we're going to talk about working with org lists uh, for non Emacs users, um, assuming that you might be using on a Mac or something else. So, first thing, find the org mode file that you want, and you should be able to double click it, and it should open up Emacs. If not, you can probably do something like right click and open with Emacs. Okay, so let's get, I'm gonna open it a different way. And when you open it up, it will look like this. And you will have the sections collapsed. Now, you can see down, uh, you can see the keys that I'm pressing. I'm using a screen key this time instead of the, what I usually use. Let's make this full screen. And so we can, press tab and it will open up that list and we can go through the things and look at the things on that list and tab to close tab to open tab to close and if I press shift and tab it'll cycle through all the ones being opened or closed no the screen key is not showing up oh, so that's weird the screen key doesn't seem to show up unless I okay so we'll keep doing it this way Okay, so let's go back here, and we can look at what we have in the regular store. Now, we can mark things to do, which are things that we need to buy, or things that are done. If you press shift, and the arrow keys left and right. So one time, the left and right are done, removed it completely. So we don't really care about done, we just want either to do, or what not. And that's holding the shift key and moving around. Yeah, if we use the option key and the arrow keys up and down, we can reorder them. Very easy. And you can also, if you wanted to, add one by hand just by typing to do uh -huh. something. And if you want to get rid of it, you just delete it. What else? What else needs to be done here? And let's see what else. That's pretty much about everything that you're gonna need to do. So here we can add, we could add another one in here. If you hold down Option, Option, Shift, and Enter quickly, it'll add a to do for you. And then we can do some I don't know. Oh, we have plastic table class. Uh, plastic children. And then once you buy them, done. Now, why is this useful? Is it'll be much easier to print out from here. But I can also filter down this list by doing or to do list sorry This just worked a second ago. Show to the tree. Right. That will show me just the things that I have to do. So if I print it out, we will give me a much shorter list. And that's what's nice about doing it this way. Okay, so that was a quick one just on the basics of using org mode. And you can also, there's other things like org, let me see, for, sorry, if 
you are a uh, Emacs noob, you will probably have have a menu bar up here, and you can from here you can also do a lot of things. Uh, navigating headings, you can go. It might be different. Right. And then once you're done, you can save it from probably from your, it might be different if you're using Aqua Emacs, but regular Emacs is control XS. Save it. And then you can go back here and you can send it as an email attachment. And that's pretty much it. Pretty easy stuff. This is a short video. Let me know if you guys are watching this and if you want um, to see any more of these type of videos for non-Emacs users. Okay, call to.